so obsessed with Muslim women and the veil. I mean, the veil's a symbol of controversy, right? Except when it's on a nun's head. But a Muslim woman, oh, she's oppressed. Unveiled is a solo performance piece uh, that was written by Rohina Malik, uh, an artist based in Chicago. She wrote the play in response to events that happened to her personally after 9-11. In the months and the years following 9-11, there were more and more incidents of uh, violence towards Muslims in America. So she felt she needed to respond to that somehow, and she started writing this play. What do you represent? That question is the heart of hip-hop. I represent Islam. It was hip-hop that made me realize that. I think like the sky. My name's Shabana, not Osama, not Bin Laden. I'm not a bomber. And then each story is, is different. Each of the women are uh, culturally different. One is Pakistani, one is Moroccan, one is um, British. So we get the different perspectives from um, different Muslim cultural backgrounds. I am not a terrorist. I mean, we had already decided to uh, produce this play last year before we knew anything about a man named Donald Trump. And we had already decided to bring it to South Africa before he started saying some of the stuff that he's been saying. But it just became more and more resonant. And I felt more and more important to get it out there. My grandma raised me to be tough as nails. I can still hear her voice. Anes, you better learn to be tough because you was born with two strikes against you. You're black and you're female. When I turned 21, I told grandma that I reverted to Islam. She just rolled her eyes and said, strike three. <laughs> so much about it. There are five Muslim women, but the themes about tolerance and acceptance and even in South Africa we have so many different cultures and so many races coming together and we have a small history of xenophobia as well and I felt like I had to do this show here. See people are always talking about veil and oppression but I know what real oppression is and it's called racism. So I personally have not experienced it. I don't wear the hijab, and I think that makes a difference. I feel like women who wear the hijab are walking around with a target on their backs because racists and xenophobes and Islamophobes can pinpoint, oh, she's Muslim, and so they get the brunt of it. Take it off. You look so ugly. Sweetie, take that off. It's not safe to wear that right now. I look at her like she's crazy. I've been wearing my hijab since the day I took my shahada. It's a part of me. The message of, of the play is really about opening your heart, um, being receptive to other people, other cultures, other life experiences. And I think that this play will really go a long way towards um, helping people understand Muslim women particularly. Get to know me. Get to know me.